<laughs> his MO is that he kills people that still use VHS. Oh my god, wait, this guy's naked. Hello everyone, my name is Sentinel and welcome to Harmful, the second tape. The FBI estimates that there are between 25 and 50 serial killers operating throughout the US at any given time. Serial killers are always present in society. A little spooky. That's definitely one of my biggest fears is like less monsters in horror games and more like people. Because people scare the shit out of me. <laughs> As an antisocial uh, let's player. Oh, what was this? We have received a second tape by anonymous male. And contents are disturbing. Hello? Grab that. A map of the area where we found the first tape. We searched the nearby woods and found what was left of multiple victims. Yeah, so there's this is apparently a sequel to a first the game made by the dev. I haven't played it. I don't know what goes on in it. And I don't know what quite to expect in this one. All I know is that apparently we play as an agent and a serial killer. So it's going to be interesting seeing the two views. I'm actually curious how many people here watching this video have ever used a VHS tape. Not to say that they're super old, but I remember using them as a kid. Honestly, I wonder how many of my viewers are actually Zoomers and the like, so let me know in the comments down below if you ever watched something on a VHS tape before. Okay. Uh, he's just standing there. Menacingly! Off to a great start, I guess. <laughs> Oh, uh, sorry, wrong number. I'm kind of busy watching VHS tapes and serial killers. <laughs> Hello? Hello, agent. This is the county sheriff. We got a homicide at the local gas station. We believe it's connected to the tape you found. Come as soon as you can. It seemed like it was, we received a call from the local sheriff. Oh, it seemed like it was in a barn somewhere. Murder at a gas station on Old Forest Road. The method of the killing fits our killer's mo M.O. Finally, the lead. This isn't gonna end well. It never ends well. It never ends well. Oh my god. Can we talk about the graphics in this game? I adore it. It is fantastic looking. Holy shit, gas was cheap back then. Evening agent. HQ called ahead to say you were coming. We received a call from the clerk at 10.15 p.m. Reports of a vicious assault. Crime scene is inside. Alright, well, I'll get right to it, I guess. But yeah, I absolutely adore this visual style. Like, oh, it looks so good. Good to see you. Crime scene is in the back. Look to the clerk. He's pretty shook up, not talking much. The sheriff is inside by the body. He's waiting for you. There. <laughs> I'd be honest, I'd be shook up too if I had a face like that. Uh, if I had to work at a gas station on top of having, having the night shift, and then someone gets brutally murdered... Yeah, I probably wouldn't be talking that much too. What you guys got? You guys got any Mentos here? Oh my god, he's naked. <laughs> hey, another victim. Who's doing this and why? Whoa, your chest is bent, man. God damn. Not only did he remove his genitalia, he removed his nipples too. We got one serious fucked up killer out here. All right, let's watch this tape. I'm sure it's not going to be that bad. I mean, come on. Pretty normal. 2148. Like, what, 948? Okay, so he was fully clothed coming into... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> wait, is that guy wearing a mask? Wait, wait. Oh my god. That was quick. <laughs> Where was the clerk during all this? Wait. Oh, okay. After reviewing that footage, we got another call. Local police found an accident about five miles from the gas station. Sheriff said I should get there as soon as possible. Heading there now. So, where was the clerk during all that? Maybe he stepped out for a moment or what? Oh my god, that is some serious blood. Oh my god, he must have driven over a lot of ketchup on the- Whoa, hey buddy. Evening agent, found this car abandoned in the middle of the road. Blood trail leads down this trail. Oh, I don't say path, but yeah, trail. Bestie, check it out. Can I get some backup here? Do I have a gun? I, I mean, I know I'm an agent, but you guys sure I should be heading down the road with a blood trail by myself? I feel like there's 
Oh my god. Oh, there's a body right, literally right there. Guys, I'm checking out the tr Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> Man, why am I so small? Like, am I- <laughs> Am I Markiplier? Why am I Markiplier height? Detective Markiplier on the case, I guess. Why am I so small and all these- Oh my god! What the fuck? Is Vlad the Impaler running this shit? Jesus, dude. Holy shit, this is dark. I did not expect this when I <laughs> when I booted up the game. Oh, he even left, he left us a VHS player and a CRT. Awesome. Okay, so this was at 5.37 earlier today. No, wait, it's September 12th. I don't quite remember the date from the last murder. The birds? Or two, I think crows or ravens. I can't quite tell the difference between the two. I think crows are really smart, though. I think those are the intelligent ones. There's actually a story about a woman teaching crows how to- Oh! Hello! I'm playing the game! I didn't even realize. I am sorry, everyone. Hey, pal. You just blowing from stupid town? But yeah, there's a story about a woman teaching crows how to pick up money from people. Like, they, they would bring her money and she'd give them food. So what happened was the crows started robbing people. And she got caught because it was the one lady that would be surrounded by crows <laughs> and they'd give her money. Hopefully I'm the serial killer because whoever's recording this, if you just walk out into the woods like this, I just... I don't know, man. Campsite. Maybe I'm the grizzly man. Which, that also didn't really end that well. Camping is such a... Like, I, I know some people really like nature and stuff, but there are literally grizzly bears and wolves and... Snakes, and I'm just not equipped for it. I'd much rather stay at home, playing video games and talking over them. And if you enjoy listening to me talk over video games, then maybe, you know, hit that subscribe button, like the video, and uh, click the bell so you're notified of whenever I upload. It would be very appreciated. I love you very much. My god, we are just taking our sweet time, aren't we? Where are we going, by the way? Oh my god, okay. This jumped real quick. Holy shit. Uh, oh yeah, mm-hmm. No, that's cool. Turn and look at the camera. If he doesn't, if he's not in front of the camera and spook me, I'm just... What's he doing? Why'd he move the body? He like literally moved the body in view and is looking up. I wonder what's... So he... I'm guessing the guy that was recording was from the camp, like the camper. And he was going for a walk and sat at a bench. Oh boy, another call. Hello? Hello, agent. This is the sheriff. If you got another one. Oh my god, this guy's busy. Just outside the forest, towards the farmlands. Come as soon as you can. Can I get a fucking gun or something? I know I'm just an agent. Why is there only one dude here with four cop cars? Hello? An agent, huh? About time you got here. Shut up, deputy. You could dead bitch. Some of the other officers are down this dirt road. They found something strange. Oh boy, well, there's a big ominous tree down the path, so... Who would live here? Man, cornfields are so spooky. There's something about farming and cornfields that are scary to me. I don't know what it is. Like, this should be so terrifying. Imagine running through this and something's chasing you. Spooky as shit. But being on a farm would actually be kind of nice, you know? It's very simple living. There are several buildings that look- Oh my god! <laughs> uh, you're finally here. Why you guys gotta say it so ominously? We found the body here about two hours ago. An anonymous tip called it in. It's always anonymous. It's always anonymous! God, the hacker named 4chan. Who would do something like this? We're still searching the grounds for evidence. You gotta help us out here. Alright, I'll do my best. Well, he left one stick out. I mean, that's kind of good news. He didn't shove it up the guy's butt or anything. Good for him, I guess. I'm going over here. I feel like that's the obvious place to go. There's like 15 houses, though. So I'm just going to give a quick look around. Maybe find some sweet, sweet evidence, you know? You guys sure you don't want to give me a weapon? Or maybe come with me? Or anything of the sort? Holy fuck. What is this? Another fucking tape. Okay, well, there's a big knife there. That's a little suspicious. Okay, there's a car here. Hi. Okay, thank God. 
There's some people over here. Hi there, agent. There's a VCR player set up in that room there. VCR? Is this not- is that what they're called? I don't remember. I just call them VHS players. Just like the last crime scene. Strange. I'll leave you to it. Thanks. Alright, I guess I'm going in here. I kind of want to check that other building, but I'm so slow, I'm not going to. Okay. Yay! Oh boy, is it the guy that owns the farm? Because I feel bad then. I said they were creepy as shit, and I mean... It has to be whoever owns this truck, right? No, this is cool. Yep, just going back here and... Pick up crowbar. Oh boy. So this is September 18th. The last one was September 12th. So a six day difference. Yep, just go ahead and use crowbar here. Oh, this is fucking spooky. Hello? That's a fucking big bathroom, huh? Hello? I assume I'm the killer. So if I get spooked, I'm blaming everyone but myself. Okay, there's someone there. <laughs> His MO is that he kills people that still use VHS. Oh my god, wait, this guy's naked. I mean, he lives alone, to be fair. So I don't blame him. This guy's really singling out. Oh, okay, hello. You want to wash up, man? You need a bath before we go and... Die, I guess? I don't know. Well, just move him. <laughs> why, wait, why are there two beds here? If this is the only guy here, I guess maybe whoever else lives here is gone. Well, I guess I'm kidnapping this guy. Neat. <laughs> Imagine just, he just puts him in the other bed. Dang, this killer's got a nice butt. <laughs> Interesting. So it is whoever's driving the truck then. Oh, I don't like this. Okay, another call. Hello, agent. Oh, it's in red. I hear you've been looking for me. I've never had a secret admirer like you before. You've seen my work, of course? Yes, I know you have. I think after all this time, we should meet. I've walked your kingdom, now you shall walk mine. But, you must come alone. There are others here who might get hurt. Come to 609 Oak Road, alone. Do not be afraid. Our fate cannot be taken from us. It is a gift. See you soon. No, yeah, don't, don't do it. Just call the police. It's 8 p.m. Oh my god. You know we're gonna die now. 609 Oak Road. That's where the killer wants me to go. Despite what the killer wanted, I've instructed the sheriff to arrive shortly after 9 p.m. We need to put a stop to this. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, we're so dead. Look how creepy this place is, man. Can I get, like, a baton or something? Like, I mean, I'm just saying. It, it's just, you know, like, I don't know. I mean, you know, there's a little, there's a little much. Just give me, like, anything. I don't want to go in there. There's a lot of boxes and some flies and... Oh, boy. All right. Hello. Oh, oh. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, wow. Hello. Please, for the love of God, do not jump scare me. I will scream very loudly. That's a little ominous. What the fuck is that thing? What is this, buddy? Is he like a Satan worshiper? He's not a Satanist. That's like a completely different thing. Oh, oh, yep. Hello. Boxies. Some lightsies. And a whole lot of nopesies going on here. Oh. Found another one. Pick up the key. Man, you really are... This guy needs to be put to an end. Illegally recording all these movies? <laughs> Not on my watch, bitch. Can you just, like, jump and beat me already or something? Like, I, I already expect him to do something like that. Oh, there's a lot... Oh, yeah, yay! I wonder where I'm gonna end up. <laughs> this is such a bad idea. Oh no, man. Oh, cool. How big is this building? This place is massive. Oh my god. Jesus, you have been putting in work, huh? How much money do you think it costs to have a set? Oh. Oh boy. Wow, that's a lot of naked dudes. You, uh, really just- Oh! My fucking- God damn it. <laughs> what? Oh, I see Nick. Oh, no. Uh, wow, you all dressed up for me, huh? 
Do we at least talk about this? You know, maybe the sheriff's going to be here at 9 p.m., right? Isn't it 8? That's not very shortly after. That's all I'm saying. That's like an hour. A lot can happen in an hour. <laughs> Who's crying? Am I crying or is... Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, and he burned it down. Oh! So he died with us, right? He set the place on fire and killed us. I mean, he was gonna get caught anyway, so... Wow. This tape is the property of the FBI. Distribution, distribution of any kind is strictly prohibited. The events that you've seen occurred over the course of a few days in 1997. When authorities arrived at the location, 609 Oak Road, they found the premise burnt to the ground. Upon searching grounds, they found the charter remains of numerous victims. Amongst them was Agent Willis. The authorities were unable to locate the kill. Oh my god, he lived? Oh, the killer is still at large. Yay, we did it. We did it, Reddit. We solved the case. Created by Dan McGrath. An excellent job, Dan. Good job. It was really fun. I kind of want to play the first one. I'm not too sure if I will. But overall, really fun. It was cool seeing the perspectives from uh, the killer and the agent. And it was really nice, all the different set pieces. Uh, there was definitely the nice creepy vibe and atmosphere to it. And overall, I recommend it. And it's only $2. You guys can pick it up on itch.io and uh, play it for yourselves if you'd like. There is always a link in the description down below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!